From dealing with student loans to tackling surprise expenses and the ever-growing inflation, expenses can really add up. But here's the silver lining. You don't have to fall into every financial pitfall out there. By sidestepping these five common money traps, you'll have more room to dodge debt, prep for retirement, and pave your way towards lasting wealth. Let's dive in and make sure these traps are history. Money trap number one, credit card debt. Ah, the plastic card that seems innocent enough, but can quickly lead to a financial maze. You guessed it, we're talking about credit card debt. Now, I know, this might not be new information, but it's like that classic tune you can't help but hum along to. It's worth a repeat. Picture this, the average APR on your credit card hovers north of 16%. That's no joke. And guess what? Many folks find themselves caught in this web. Back in May 2020, CNBC shook the financial world by revealing that a staggering 47% of Americans had some sort of credit card debt. Hold on to your hats because the average family was carrying around a hefty $6,270 balance. Hold the phone, there's more. Even before the whole pandemic situation, a solid 23% of Americans were diving into debt just to cover their basic needs. Talk about a tightrope walk. Here's where things start to get wild. Credit card balances tend to snowball faster than you can say, financial freedom. It's like trying to catch a fast-moving train with a skateboard. Tough luck. Life has its surprises, we get it. But guess what? You can be prepared. Start off with a cool $1,000 emergency fund as your safety net. Then, aim to pump it up until you've got enough to keep you cozy for three to six months. That way, the credit card won't be your go-to when life throws you a curveball. Now, let's take a spin on the merry-go-round of why steering clear of credit card debt is as cool as sipping a smoothie on a sunny day. Imagine if you took that not-so-cool $6,270, the average family's credit card debt, and invested it like a pro in a mutual fund returning a cool 16.22%, which, by the way, is the same as that sneaky APR. Fast forward 40 years without adding a single dime more, and guess what? You have a hopping $2.5 million in your pocket. Yes, you read that right, $2.5 million. By ditching that credit card debt, you're basically telling your future self, you're welcome for not holding back your dreams of being fabulously wealthy. So, folks, let's give credit where credit is due to your financial well-being. Let's keep those credit cards in check and keep the journey to financial freedom smooth as silk. Money trap number two, playing the lottery. Picture this, the bright lights, the anticipation, and the thrill of imagining hitting the jackpot. It's no surprise that the lottery pulls in roughly half of all Americans, but let's unravel the reality behind this enticing game. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, an average of $1,038, or about $86 a month, gets spent on the lottery each year. While the dream of a big win keeps players hooked, the cold, hard truth is that the odds are stacked against us. In fact, your chances of scoring that elusive jackpot less than one in a hopping 302.5 million. Hold on though, let's pivot to a smarter strategy that's got your back, wealth building without the smoke and mirrors. Imagine redirecting that same $86 monthly into a broad-based index fund, like the dependable STWSX from Schwab or VTSAX from Vanguard. These funds mirror the entire stock market and have historically returned around 10% annually. Buckle up for this mind-blowing revelation. If you opt for the mutual fund route, that $86 investment per month could swell to a jaw-dropping $45,761.55 in just 40 years. Here's the scoop. Investing in the stock market for the long haul is your golden ticket. Plus, those seemingly harmless money habits, like splurging on lottery tickets, have a sneaky cost that adds up over time. So, are you ready to skip the smoke and mirrors and step into the world of smart money moves? Your future self will thank you. Money trap number three, waiting for a raise to start investing. If I had a dollar for every time I heard a friend or coworker mention they'd dive into their 401 contributions once their income bumped up, I'd probably be booking my retirement cruise for next year. But here's the scoop. This approach has a triple whammy of downsides. First off, let's face it, there's never going to be a perfect moment to kickstart your investment journey. 
It's so tempting to splurge what's left over each month when you're fresh into the full-time gig world, soaking in that newfound financial freedom. Yet, the truth is, getting the investment ball rolling is easier during this simpler phase of life. Now, on to the second hiccup. If you make it a habit to spend your entire paycheck, squirreling nothing away, it becomes second nature. So when you do get a fatter paycheck, guess what? Your inner shopping spree enthusiast might take the wheel instead of your savings savvy side. That's why I've got a hot tip. Start investing a slice of your very first paycheck and then dial up that investment percentage bit by bit as time goes on. This savvy move means that when that sweet raise comes knocking, you'll be eyeing it as a chance to leap ahead financially, not as an excuse to go on a spending spree. And the grand finale. Waiting around before you start investing can take a mega toll on your financial future. Time, my friend, is the superstar ingredient in building your wealth. So by starting your investment journey today, you're setting yourself up for a future with way more financial muscle, all without having to say goodbye to those everyday joys. Money trap number four, neglecting life insurance and estate planning. Embrace the fact that life is an incredible journey with an inevitable destination. While we can't take our wealth on the next adventure, we can leave a meaningful legacy for our loved ones. Imagine being able to handle funeral costs gracefully and leaving behind a small treasure for those you cherish. Yet, dismissing life insurance might lead to tough financial times for your family if the unexpected knocks on your door. Thankfully, securing life insurance is surprisingly affordable and brings profound peace of mind. And hey, some policies even have a neat cash value feature that you can tap into if you hit a financial snag or find yourself navigating tricky life situations like a divorce. Now, let's talk about something equally crucial, having a will. Picture this as your way of shaping the future even when you're not around. By having a solid will in place, you get to decide who gets what once you completed this chapter of life. Without one, the state steps in and takes the wheel, deciding the destiny of your estate according to their rules. So why not take control and make sure your wishes, not some legal jargon, determine the inheritance story for your loved ones? Money trap number five, turning the little luxuries into everyday necessities. Now, let's talk about a sneaky spending pitfall. Those little treats, like that cup of joe on your morning commute, aren't the culprits behind your financial hurdles. But here's the twist, it's so easy to unknowingly morph them into regular necessities. Suddenly, that daily caffeine fix, the splurge on guacamole, and the urge for weeknight takeout start drilling a hole as big as your dreams into your wallet. But don't fret, here's a clever strategy to put the brakes on this devious kind of lifestyle inflation. Keep tabs on how often you indulge in these not-so-ordinary luxuries during a week or month. If you spot a surge, take a breather for a couple of weeks to break the emerging habit. Pro tip, jot down those little temptations that might sneak into your routine on a list and keep it where you'll eyeball it often. I stash mine right at the top of my budget and spending tracker. That visual cue keeps me vigilant against impulse snacks, fleeting beauty trends, and irresistible bargain decor. Let's keep those cash-draining habits in check. Remember, your financial journey is your own, and steering clear of these money traps is like giving your future self a high five. By avoiding these pitfalls, you're not just protecting your hard-earned cash, you're also setting yourself up for a brighter financial future. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more money-smart content.